Howdy, this is Lemmy with RevZilla, here to talk to you today about Mitas E07 tires. You should be looking into a Mitas E07 tire if half of your motorcycling life is spent on the pavement, but the other half is spent getting dirty somewhere off the beaten trail. Now these are currently going to fit a wide variety of bikes. I'm talking XRs, XTs, uh, DLs, GSs, man that's a bunch of letters. If you have a dual sport or an adventure style bike though, the E07 is a tire you're probably going to be interested in. This is competing with tires like the Heidenau K60 Scout or perhaps the Mifo Explorer if you're shopping for other stuff. So let's get into what makes the E07 special. This is actually one of our multi-time gear guide winners as far as tires are concerned. And the reason is the E07 brings to the table one of these modified Chevron tread patterns you can see here that's become all the rage for 50-50 tires. That is, those of you who are spending half your life on the road and half of your life off. Now the reason the E07 differs just a little bit from some of the other competitors in the field really stands out for two main reasons as far as I'm concerned. The first is going back to that chevron pattern. You can see here this is actually a broken center rib. The center rib is not continuous in here. What that means is you're going to be trading off maybe a little bit of on-road longevity and noise for increased hook off-road. So especially if you're in like say an uphill ascent situation, these tires are going to bite in probably just a little bit better than something that has a straight continuous center rib running down the tire. Now the second big winner as far as I'm concerned with the E07 is the Dakar version of this tire. So these tires come in standard version, but the Dakar version offers a puncture resistant sidewall. I think that's going to be super important for some of you guys depending on where it is that you're riding. I know up here in the northeast we often think of terms of woods and mud. However, those of you riding in the southwest, I know if you've ever run into some choya cactus, a spine can end your day rather quickly. Those of you riding around say the Ozarks, maybe a little bit of chert rock, again that's the sort of stuff that can kill a less or tires that the car sidewall might be a little added insurance to keep you from having a trip that ends early. Now, I think these are a pretty decent tire. We actually have a couple folks running these on staff. They really seem to like them. I can't wait to get a set onto my XR, but my opinion is not the only game in town. Click that info button, read some reviews, educate yourself a little bit on the E07, see how some other riders who are rocking them on a similar bike liked them. If you've got some more questions that I didn't cover here, perhaps Fitman, or you want to just hear a little bit more about how these perform, don't be afraid to get in touch with one of our gear geeks, 877-792-9455, or you can always get us by email too. See us at RevZilla.com. I'm Lemmy, I'm out of here.